I wrote Sweat because I saw a storm coming and I wanted to write something about the trauma that working class people were experiencing during the economic downturn and particularly during the um, period of deindustrialization. Um, I want to thank, first of all, the people from Reading, Pennsylvania and the steelworkers who opened up their hearts to me and who I thought would be incredibly reticent but felt like they were invisible and wanted a voice. And so I thank them for being open-hearted and telling their stories. And, and now I want to thank the women who are on these stage. And men. <laughs> <laughs> and um, um, Lynette Linton, who was the soulful director of Sweat. And Josie O'Rourke from the Dunmar Warehouse, who's not up here with us, but should be, who was brave enough to present this play about working class people. I want to thank Claire Perkins and Martha Plimpton and Patty and Leanne and Will and Sule and Osi, who are not with us. I just, this is such a glorious moment for me. And I just remember coming to London when I was 20 years old to see theater because I wanted to be a theater artist and I survived on ramen noodles and porridge and nearly starved to death. And so I'm addressing this to all of you up there is that, you know, you must dare to dream big because it does happen. Thank you.